It's a scene straight out of the X-Files. That's unreal. I've never seen anything like it. What are they? A family in Las Vegas insisting something is out there after allegedly having a close encounter of the third kind. I swear to God, this is not a joke. One witness calling 911 after they say an object fell out of the sky and landed in their backyard. They're like nine foot, ten foot tall. They look like aliens to us. Big eyes, they have big eyes. A mysterious object fell from the sky. Even the officers apparently saw that. The green glow of the alleged UFO was seen on this newly released body camera footage. I bought a bike, bro. I've always thought it should be a star that these people said there's aliens in their backyard. So when that 911 call came in, less than an hour later, police were ready to believe it. It was like a big creature. A big creature? Yeah, like a long time to talk. I'm not going to be yes or yes. One of my partners said they saw some fall out of the sky too, so that's why I'm kind of curious. Did you see anything land in your backyard? Or? But after a brief investigation of the yard, officers closed the, <laughs> the case as unfounded. It does, it does. history of UFOs, right? I mean, right in, in one story, right? Somebody sees something, and then you get a story, and but there's never anything to do, you know, to have. there's never any real evidence. There's never anything that lasts. There's never anything that science, which allows us to have this amazing conversation over these wires, can do anything with. And so, like, right here is the entire history of UFO. research, I've worked very closely with a man named Dr. Heitz Verber, and he's taken me through deep regression hypnosis. I've been able to go into my own repressed memories to the night my sister disappeared. I can recall a bright light outside and a presence in the room. I was paralyzed, unable to respond to my sister's calls for help. Listen to me, Scully. This thing exists. But how do you... The government know? knows about it. And I gotta know what they're protecting. Yeah. No, Nothing change. else matters to me. And this is as close as I've ever gotten to it. I 
see birds of heaven. We feel good. Feel good. Feel good. Hello? What? Who is this? Who is it? That was some woman. It just said Peggy O'Dell was dead. The girl in the wheelchair? We have two individuals here, each verifying the other story. Well, thanks a lot. You really bleeped up this case. Well, of course, he didn't actually say bleeped. He said... I'm uh, familiar with uh, Detective Manners' colorful phraseology. Hey, I just got a call from some crazy bleep head claiming he was an eyewitness to this alien abduction. You feel like talking to this blank hole? Hey, I just got a call from some crazy blankety blank claiming he found a real live dead alien boy. Detective Manners. He said they just found a broken UFO. The guy who cast them over this will die of prostate cancer at the age of 82. Do you receive any other impressions from it? It's ugly. Next. Scully. No, what's wrong? Well, nothing is wrong. I'm just at that special place and I wanted to share it with you. Let's go. Let's go. 
question. Someone trashed the autopsy bay in the lab and they stole the body. We're going back to the motel. What? They stole the corpse? There goes my computer! The X-rays and pictures! the summer we graduated. It's happened to my friends, too. That's why I need you to protect me. I'm scared. I might die like the others, like Peggy did tonight. Your father's the medical examiner. You were the one on the phone. You told me Peggy would have been killed. It's the medical examiner. You were the one on the phone. You told me Peggy O'Dell had been killed. Tracy, your father. What is...
baby's father is an alien. No, no, I didn't say he was an alien. I said he was from another planet. His name is Luke Skywalker. He's what's known as a Jedi Knight. Did he have a lightsaber? No, he didn't bring it. He did sing the song for me, though. This man's body is quite a scientific specimen, and, and thankfully it's preserved and intact. In other words, there are 654 muscles in the human body, and this man essentially has 655. What would be the uh, purpose of, of this uh, muscle? You got me, Mulder. I, you know, maybe none. Well, um, if, if this musculature underlies the entire skin, then, then maybe it could be utilized to remold the skin shape and texture. Which would go a long way to explaining why we're looking for a man who can appear to be his own father, or anyone else for that matter. Is it likely, Mulder, that this man simply has an identical, identical twin? Check that out.
Praying mantis? Yeah, I had a praying mantis epiphany, and as a result, I screamed. You know, not, not, a, not a girly scream, but the scream of someone being confronted by some before unknown monster that had no right existing on the same planet I inhabited. Alder, are you sure it wasn't a girly scream? Anybody recognize this woman? That's the lady that got murdered. And does anybody recognize this man? Oh, yes, yes. He did it. He did it. Murder. He's a very funny man. He smiles a lot. But I do harbor a suspicion that you can see things about this girl. Things that we can't see. you. 